The name's Crow. Russell Crow. Good morning guys and welcome back to the vlog number 11 and today I'm with my friend Max and what we're going to be doing is we're just going to discuss what the hell we want to do and then we're just going to go do it. So let's do it! Okay, so we just got to Queen's Elizabeth Country Park and now we're walking up the hill and as you can tell, it is very, very steep. <laughs> we like started like a couple of minutes ago and our, my calves are still hurting. Well, our highest. What we're going to be doing is we're going to go try and find the king's chair and show you where my base was from when I was a kid. So we have just found a wild rabbit. Now watch as it's graceful in its prime. Here it is, the wild rabbit. So we just had this funny little incident where he's just dared me to run up and touch that branch of the tree and I've literally gone like this with such purpose running up and then I just went and I don't know why it was so funny about it we just completely just went absolutely crazy and just started laughing our heads off because I like proper went for it and then I just went oh, stopped and I'm a bit of an idiot and now let's go right so I found my old base from when I was like really little with all my friends I'm used to like if you can just about see there's like a little camping area just over there where you can have like barbecues and stuff and anyways you would like this base used to be huge like you can see it like right here uh, you can see it right here this used to be all fortified like that like proper fortified and i'll show you what it would used to look you'd come up to the base like over here and and then this would all be fortified like proper like full to the brim there'd be an inside part here where you'd walk then all across here would be a wall then down this part would be a wall as well and then around here would be the rest of the wall <laughs> but there'd only be one little area that you could get in it was like this little bridge that you could get in you just to hide and this is when we used to have like stick wars when we were little kids and stuff we used to use the chalk which was on the ground and that as the currency so if you wanted to buy like new weapons like say for instance you wanted to trade this stick you would have to give like two bits of chalk for this stick and then basically it was just it was just really nice to have like stick walls i remember being crouched down in this den just over here and i was like sat down i remember i was like about 10 like 9 10 i was about like 9 10 i remember looking through this little hole bit and there was and one of the uh one of my friend max's brother's friends he launched a log and it went straight through the den hit me in the face and chipped my chipped a bit of my tooth but it was one of my baby teeth and I just, and it split my lip as well, and it just pissed out blood. It's just really annoying to see the base completely destroyed, and I know why they've destroyed the base. It's because they've turned most of this into like a like a airsofting paintball area, and they've just destroyed the den. And I'm just like, that is childhood gone. Because we would go to the den every year; it'd be the exact same, and we would just have stick wars and fight and beat the crap out of each other with logs. Which was fun. So, now let's go try and find the king's chair. Right, we've just found out that the king's chair is actually been dismantled. And they've rebuilt it for this one here. So, 
it's it's like more safe because the one that we used to climb up was like like an art installation so the only way to get up was like this little bit of broken log and when you're a kid you don't have much fear but I'm guessing all the parents complained oh it's going to be a bit unsafe so take it down and make something safer the whole point of it was you're not meant to be up there so we're gonna climb it but there is a climbing net there and I'm very tempted to climb to the top let's do it <laughs> Okay, so we've just got to the top of the king, the new king's chair, which I'm still pissed about. But I shouldn't be really pissed because of, well, it's still fun to climb up. We climbed, well, I climbed up this lovely part over here, which is like a net thing. I can't remember what it's actually called. And then you can see this lovely little view over here. And then there's other bits. And Max was trying to get up it and I wouldn't let him up because I'm a dickhead. <laughs> so it ended up as while we were getting down, we were turning into a battle against each other with Bark. So we've just been like throwing stuff at each other, which, which, which actually was a nice bit of fun. Uh, <laughs> and now we're just like on the way walking down this path down here. And we're going to head down this path over here. This is like kind of like the, the path to the car park at the moment. And then we're going to have to make our way down the steep hill. So let's do this. I actually just forgot that there's a monkey bars and park all over here. So what we're going to do is we're going to play on the park. So I think you know what time it is. It's time lapse time of a park. Right, so we're just on the way back. We've just come down from up there and another hill on top of that. And now we've just found the path and we're just gonna make our way back to the car. And I don't know what else we're gonna do, but it has been a really good day. Right, so we're in the car and we're just heading our way back right about now. And we're just coming back from Queen Elizabeth and we're gonna head back to mine, I presume. And we'll go from there. So, um, I've had a little bit of a rummage around in Max's car, and there's Mr. Max. He's quite embarrassed right now, because I asked him a simple question. Why has he got a tampon in his car? It's not mine. <laughs> <laughs> right, so we're just on the way back for from the old shops. We got a drink, and guess what we found? We found a hedgehog. We're gonna leave him be, but he's a lovely little fella. <laughs> Hello, mate. Now, I haven't seen a hedgehog in years, and we were just walking back and we were just like, oh, there's a hedgehog. <laughs> so that's really nice to see in the evening. Right, so it's the end of the evening. It looks brighter than what it is on the actual camera that I'm looking at right now. And what we're doing now is Max is going to go home and I am going to edit this vlog. So, as always, I hope you guys have a lovely rest of the week. I hope you guys have a lovely rest of the day. And I shall see you next week on vlog number 12 next week on Sunday. Have a great week, guys.